Hello everyone. Welcome to hands-on ICD10 coding tutorial, session zero, prerequisite. In this session, I will give you some advice on what learning material to get in order to make this ICD10 tutorial hands-on. What makes this ICD10 tutorial different than all others out there is that I emphasize hands-on learning experience. I truly believe the philosophy of learning by doing. So I ask you to follow along the tutorial and actually code all the IC10 examples while you're watching the video. So what is the prerequisite? What do we need to make this tutorial hands-on? There are three options. Option one is to buy the uh, physical book. You can order from Amazon by typing ICD-10 CM 2019. It usually costs around 100 bucks. Option two is free. You can download five PDF files from the internet. Make sure it's 2019 edition. The first file is ICD-10 CM tablet list. The second PDF is indexed to diseases and injuries. The third and fourth PD, uh, table of neoplasm, table of drugs. The final file is indexed to external cause of injuries. Let me show you how we can find this file on internet. So you can go to Google and then type in ICD-10CM tabular list. 2019 PDF. And then the first link from CDC is what we need. So I have uh, downloaded the file beforehand. This is the file ICD-10CM tabular list of diseases and injuries. So this is what a typical typical page looks like. So again, let's go to search for the second file, ICD-10CM index 2019 PDF. The third link here from CDC is what we need. So again, I just want to show you how it looks like. ICD-10CM index to diseases and injuries. So the words in capital, that's the main term. And then the word with uh, one dash is the level one subterm, two dashes, that's level two subterm. Now let's search for the uh, tables, ICD-10, CM, Neoplasm. 2019 PDF. So the first link from CDC. So again, I have uh, downloaded this beforehand ICD 10 CM table of neoplasm. So this is how a page look like. Then let's, let's search for the table of drugs. Jux 2019 PDF. Yeah, this link from CDC. That's what we need. Again, I have this file already downloaded. SD10 CM table of drugs and chemicals. So a typ typical page will look like this. Let's go search for the final file. ICD and cm uh, index to external cause 2019 pdf so this link here from cdc is what we need so again i have this file pre-downloaded external cause of injuries index This is how the page looks like. Okay.
So we have shown you how to download those five files. And then third option is to get some online books and coding software. This could be uh, free and also it can cost you money. So here I will show you how to get a free account at www.medicalcodecenter.com. There are two steps to sign up account. First, fill out the registered form. And then step two is to click the activation link in your email to activate your account. So let me show you how we do this. So this is the website. Go to the account, register, and then type in your email address, password, and retype your password, and then fill out other uh, fields of the form. After you're done, you just click the create account. After create account, then you can go to email. You will receive email like this. And then there's an activation link here. You just need to click it on it. If the uh, link doesn't work, you can just copy this link and paste it into your browser. So because I already activated. If you didn't, then you, uh, if it's the first time activation, it will say your account was activated. So now you just need to log on to your account. So my advice to click to check the uh, remember me. This way you only need to log in once in a day. Otherwise we will log out in one hour. So just click login. Now you have access to this website. Under ISD10CM, you have the tabular list here. It's called browsed ISD10CM book. And then you have index to disease and uh, uh, let me show you this look like and then there's index here you can search index and you can browse the index here so and then you have a table of neoplasm again you can do a browse uh, or you can do a search also you have the jock table here so this is all you need. Let's go back to the slide. Oh. So next, I will just show you quickly how to change your password or reset your password. Go to the website here, go to account, and then change password. You. You can only change your password if you know your old password. So you type in your old password, type in new password, and then retype the uh, new password, and then click change your password. If you don't know your old password, you forget your password, then you have to do a password reset. Let's go to login page here, and then there's forget a password, and then reset my password. So here you just you type in your email address. request to set password and then you go to email here so you immediately get an email here there's a link to reset your password again if the link doesn't work you can just copy the link and paste it into your browser so you just type in your new password reset oh it doesn't match huh? 
Okay. So we are done at this uh, tutorial. Thank you very much for watching.